Good kitten internet. <laughs> so as you can see, we're not exactly in a normal configuration right now. Um, we actually moved today. And there's one chair on this entire floor of the apartment. And I'm sitting in it. Mm -hmm. There's my chair upstairs, but we could bring it down, but we wouldn't want to bring it back up again. Yeah, that stairwell is a little on the narrow side, and it would take two people to bring it up and downstairs. And we are tired. Mm -hmm. We do have chairs that are on their way, although they haven't shipped yet, so I don't know when they're going to arrive. So I'm sitting on the step stool. Yep. <laughs> so... And I'm also playing this using my work monitor. So this is going to be interesting. Um, yeah. Okay. And I had it running for a bit. That's the reason why there's um, autosaves after. I just had it running while I was testing out settings. Okay. Last we left off, we finished the frog quest. Mm -hmm. The quest that makes it easy to level outpost engineering skill. No, wait, no, we no, just picked we, it up. We picked it okay. up, yeah. Well, then I know exactly what we need to do. Because you just did this on your other character, didn't you? Huh? Do not want to see Sidonia's budget accommodations then. Yes. <laughs> This is so weird, you being that short. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, if I'm actually sitting up tall, I do look really tall usually. Not down. I think there's one down this one. Oh yeah, I think you're right. But I'm not seeing it on the quest marker. Oh, because I don't have it as a quest. Good quest, I mean. Yeah, I thought there was one down there. Yeah, this is one that you have to have the quest markers for, because... Otherwise, you're going to have to search every wall. Yes. That's not there. That's behind. Yeah, and even with the quest markers, it's kind of hard. Yeah. That one. Ooh, screen tearing. Yes. Also... Are you using auto move? No. You had this once before, didn't you? Yes. Um, battery might be running a little low on this keyboard. Hmm. Um, Can you... Yes, in? if I had a USB-C cable. Um, there's an A to C cable back on the... On top of boxes. It's the red cable. It's from your setup. As mentioned, we just moved today. And it's pitch black outside. <laughs> now, also, the lighting conditions in here are pretty awful. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, but I'm the one who really wanted to play Starfield. Yes. So, do not feel bad for them being so short at the moment. It's my idea. Yes. <laughs> Come on. Be nice if it was on the top, but not for this one. is charging. I can just switch it to cable mode instead. So I don't have Bluetooth to deal with at all now. That should help. Um, I know there's others that are accessible from here. And I'm not wearing my glasses because this is actually close enough where my glasses do not help. And they were just adding a bunch of glare to the recording. But yeah, um, I don't know if, I don't think I've ever actually mentioned this in any video, but I sit much taller than a normal person. I love the frogs. Space frogs, so awesome. What's even the point of doing it that way? The miners pretty much are on the lower level. Um, so what it is is that they and I actually have the exact same length legs. And I'm, what, half foot taller than you? Mm-hmm. Yeah. You're significantly taller than me, but we have the same length legs. Yeah, so we can wear the same pants. <laughs> yep. But that also means that when you see me sitting, I'm usually slouching quite a bit. I stood tall specifically to make it more ridiculous looking. But yeah, this is actually the way I would sit normally if I was sitting at a normal 
in a normal person manner instead of like this like I normally do. Um, I know my grandmother has a photo someplace of myself, my father, and my uncle all sitting on a couch and all of us looking the same height. My father was six foot three or six foot four and my uncle is six foot six. It's just a little ridiculous how much of a difference there is between my torso length and my leg length. Anyway, bam, space frog. Taking God is what God is. No, it isn't. No, it isn't. It's human curiosity and ingenuity. Yep. Uh, blowing up stuff again. Three, two, one. Um, is kind of a crap hole. And it's this floor that our friend is on. I just know people are going to love those new drugs. I sure am glad you're helping me. Hi! Thanks for doing that for me. I wish I could do it myself, but having a friendly adult help me is almost as good. Anything to help bring a smile to people's faces. I know, right? Last time I did this, lots of people came over to tell me how much they loved it. I only hope these drawings stay up longer this time. Anyways, it's not much, but I got a little something for you as a thank you. Twelve credits. And you can now build space, far, uh, space frog posters at your outposts. And let's try to listen for the uh, uh, PA announcement about it this time. Okay. I did not hear it on my other character. Yeah, I just saw the subtitle and heard a couple of words of it. Watch out for the robots. They're surprisingly sneaky. Nope. Also, nope. I don't care what anyone says. This is still a tough Ah, so you see barracks. There might be a nice scene in here. Like that right there on the table. Oh, yeah. Although, oh. I mean, actually, I don't size. think I found that on my character. I just <laughs> had the idea that there's probably a magazine in here. You see how much this glows? Yeah. It's not actually glowing. It's this monitor. Then this was supposed to be a color accurate monitor, too. It's just missing colors. Anything that's close to white just becomes white. Like, this is my work monitor because I wanted a monitor that would work with over USB-C. And I wanted something high resolution because I am a software developer and I use every square pixel of resolution. Um, hey, you looking for anything in particular? Yes. But you are not Percival. Percival is here. No, he isn't. Invoices can be collected from the... Oh. Not here for a delivery, are you? Captain Brenick, Vanguard. I need Percival Walker's help investigating a troubling discovery. Do you know? Well, I do wish I could help you, Captain, but Dr. Walker has been missing for some time. So quick. <laughs> we had such high hopes for Percival. I brought him on myself to do medical and biological consulting around the city. Not the sort of work the Trade Authority traditionally does. But we thought it had the potential to become a whole new type of revenue stream for our branch. 
I invested no small amount of personal capital into the endeavor. Oh, but shame. then he decided to run off after a discipline issue. I presume the miners have him hidden somewhere. Plenty of cracks on this old rock. But at this point, it's probably for the best. How did the miners fight him? They were all devils. Red devils. A UC Marine unit based here on Mars, though they were disbanded shortly after the colony war. I presume a number of them served alongside Dr. Walker. Bonds forged in battle and all that. You remember the Red Devils from uh, the terminal entries at the Crete Research Facility? Yeah. It's the uh, Xeno Warfare uh, Division. Ah, yep. So, what type of discipline issue are we talking about here? Dr. Walker decided to start brewing and selling his own pharmaceuticals to our customers below cost. Yeah, I see which part of that you have a problem with. Something his contract expressly forbade. As such, we requested our cut of the profits and began garnishing his salary. Perhaps a little too severely, but well within legal limits. It was around then that he ran off. Abandoning his duty and his unpaid accounts. You don't really sound particularly interested in finding him. That's out. correct. We're no longer interested in Dr. Walker's services. He did leave his post, however, with a sizable debt to his name. If you were to find him and get him to pay, the trade authority would be most grateful for it. Yep. Oh, someone owes you bloodthirsty leeches money? Oh, I'm sorry, that's rude of me. Yeah, it's an insult to leeches. There we go. <laughs> How much does he owe, anyway? Why? Feeling charitable? I don't recall the exact figure off the top of my head, but with the interest it's accrued, I believe it's something substantial. So if you were able to find him and convince him to clear his accounts, you would have our honest gratitude. Um, pretty sure there's nothing honest about the trade authority. Just tell me where he was last seen. You want to help the trade authority? Who? You know who these guys are, right? Wonderful. I suggest paying a visit to the Sixth Circle, what I suppose is technically a bar on the lowest level of the city. If anyone knows where Percival is, the miscreants there would. But I would urge caution. They're not a group known for their hospitality. Sorry about that, Sam. Uh, wherever you went. Where did Sam go? Oh. I don't know why it said talk to him, man. But of course. Because Enjoy. that's just giving you a... Plutonium. Yeah. <laughs> Which you had in your pocket, apparently. Okay. Don't Sam, you're, you're weird. That's a good reason to not join the Vanguard. Broken spears upstairs. Go drown yourself there. This bar is for devil's vets and their kin. Why are you looking at the sky? Doc Walker? You're barking up the wrong... Andy, you. Why don't you come here and tell me what's up? I should probably have said that. Not supposed to talk to you. I don't understand you, but that might get them friendlier. Hmm. Why do you save again? Have it. Hmm? It's really, really hard not Straight to stare at top the sky. Wanders into my bar, asking Shit, after a man again. like Percival Walker. And I can't hear what sound I'm saying. What do you want with him? Hadrian. A woman named Hadrian sent you, a member of the Vanguard, to find Percival. Hmm. Now, if that tag's a forgery, it's a damn good one. 
All right, Captain. If you are who you say, Supra et Ultra. Vanguard motto. <laughs> what does it mean? Should have gotten that during the road. Even beyond. I mean, it's kind of cheating because I can also read Latin. Mm -hmm. mm, I see. And tell me, what grade was it you got on your entrance exam? A, C, D plus? Yeah, the Vanguard entrance exam isn't graded like that. That is right. All right, Captain. <laughs> Maybe you are who you say you are. But look. Even if I decided I was going to help you get in contact with Dr. Walker, Percival made himself scarce for a reason. His debt to the Trade Authority. But if someone resolved that debt, well, Percival wouldn't have to hide anymore. It's only like... I can bet that person would make I don't a know how much it is. Percival yeah, I do. ...and the rest of us devils. And I'm always inclined to help a friend. That's good to hear. Now, you want my opinion. The most straightforward way to take care of this debt would be to just saunter up to the authority and pay him direct, if you've got credits to throw away. Of course, rumor is the trade authority keeps all their records <laughs> and collections files on a central server inside their storeroom. That's dumb of them. If someone was to break in there and Adjust Percival's debt to something a little more reasonable, say, a few hundred credits? I'd be happy to cover the costs. I mean, clearly that's a crime. And doing it would just be terrible. But, uh, <laughs> one friend of Hadrian's to another, Sidonia's full of <laughs> Wouldn't be surprised if there was one that let out right into the authority storeroom. Say with an entrance behind the bar at the Broken Spear? Ooh, and you might need these. Let's <laughs> <laughs> say you get out there and help Dr. <laughs> that didn't happen to me. Really? I think I didn't uh, name drop Hadrian. Mm. And also... What? Problem was, I didn't hear what he had said. Some probably something like, "Hey, you need to talk to me." Talk with Luke. So you're going to help Doctor Walker? Oh, good, good. Oh, Percival's a good guy. Listen, I know how you can do it without having to resort to any B and E. Aqueous hematite. Mars is full of it. People think it's just garbage. But Percival and I, we've been working on some projects in the deep mines. At least when he wasn't slaving away at his trade authority contract. But we stumbled on a way to make it useful and profitable. You give our research over to Octai at the trade authority, it should more than cover Percival's debt. That guy's always looking for an angle. I'm sorry, who are you? Oh, I'm Cambridge. I was Percival's assistant. Well, apprentice, really couldn't work in the mines anymore so he gave me a job helping with some of his side projects no his experiments inside and out and i know this one was going to be big it's mostly iron in about three centuries of human water runoff though only percival would be able to tell you all the trace elements and whatnot but it builds up around human settlements and something about the martian soil changes it makes it into something new we think we found a use for it. Yeah, because the trade has already mentioned that you were making pharmaceuticals. No, 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 no. Well, yes, but, but the medical kind. I'd help him make whatever the city was running low on that month, and we'd sell it to the miners for cheap. But the trade authority got wind and wanted their cut. And then some. Well, yeah. We were never able to finish the research. The spacers moved in and ran us out. Started setting up shop. Now that sounds like something. Oh, so it's a tiny little favor. Just mind the mindful of armed rabble. Yep, pretty much. But if you can clear them out, I can walk you through how to finish the research. Then you can give it over to the trade authority. They'll get folks working in the deep mines again. 
jobs come back, I become a modern day folk hero, <laughs> then I don't have to sleep on an inflated spacesuit anymore. What? What pillow? He sleeps on an inflated oh, spacesuit. Yeah. The biggest employer on Mars has always been Demos Star Yards. After the colony war, armistice ended Demos, needed a lot Demos. fewer warships. Fewer ships meant fewer minerals. That meant a lot of folks scrounging for work around here. I think I know what they are by now, but you know, what are spacers? Uh, a bunch of parasites and cutthroats. They're folks from the fringes of space, willing to put down anyone who tries to move in on what they've decided is theirs. <laughs> Even when it ain't. Strange this group would pick Mars as a new home. That's sure, we're not minutes. downtown New Atlantis, but there are places where they'd be bothered less than here. My guess is the authority tipped them off when they heard we were working down there. And cut off what they thought was the competition, you know? Eh, that's an awful lot of work to avoid buying a pillow. Great, great. So access to the deep mines can be found outside the city. It's not far. Shouldn't even need to hop back in your ship. We'd set up right near the main drill. Taking out the spacer leader should get the message across to the rest of them to buzz off. Once you've managed that, phone up here on the comms panel, and I can walk you through finishing the research. You know, I think we should both do the research and yeah. break in at the train. So the reason why Sam now has something to say to me again with you has been something else. because he disliked something. The best part is yeah. the the course for the next jump. I never feel at home planet side. How about you? I mean, obviously, I'm going to take the flirt prompt. Mm -hmm. It's Sam. Now that's the right answer there. <laughs> See, the people I don't get are the ones who never go anywhere. They stay in their own hometown. They just live and die there. Yeah, definitely don't know what that's like. Galaxy full of wonder and things you could never imagine. How can they be satisfied with one tiny sliver of it? I mean. Not everyone gets the opportunity. There are unfortunates that have little to no choice in anything. Dude. They have my sympathy. But there are so many people that think it's out of reach when it isn't. I think everyone should at least get out once. Go someplace, meet people. Get out of your comfort zone so you can really see that the worlds are more than just little issues and bickering. There is a mess of ugly out there, but my God, there is grandeur too. I knew you were that poetic. Space. That great void. That's the stuff for me. I want to be the code that finds something deep out there. Solomon got us here in a big way. Well, not to say that, yeah, Something but... that moves people. It makes them feel just a bit of what I feel when I jump systems. Not knowing what's next. <laughs> So many flirting prompts. Mm -hmm. Then you are a glutton for punishment. <laughs> <laughs> but I do love the way you listen. Yeah, it's funny. As much as Jacob, my dad, cashes in on the family name, he's got no adventure in him. And I get it. It's dangerous, sometimes scary out there. But that's what exploration is. Going off the map and seeing if there truly be dragons. Mm. Not one drop. He's always been about making deals, keeping goods moving. Despite his many, many flaws, I think deep down, he's just trying to do good for Aquila City. But if you're going to be name dropping Solomon all the damn time, you should act a little more like him. Here's the discovery. I couldn't ask for better company. Aww. But yes, I agree that I should be doing both. Although this character is not the greatest at stealth. You probably don't need that much stealth if you're using that. True. You can always take your recon stim or something. Yeah. Been in the Vanguard a long time. The base is That's probably 
the train authority the server room. Yeah, it is. Where do you? Oh yeah. Yeah, that's the server room. I think my other character actually went there. Just for fun? Yeah. Careful near the railings on the upper levels. It's a long way down. Uh, so far I'm not going through any ducts. Was that a person in that chair? No. Seriously, it's just advanced. I just hope this doesn't cancel out the other objective. That's why I saved. Yeah. There's seriously nobody here. Oh, it's that computer, excuse me. Somebody's in, like, Flynn? Twenty-one thousand eight hundred and sixty-seven credits. That a few hundred was okay, right? I think you shouldn't get too greedy. Like, they might notice. I think I wouldn't go lower than 2,000. Well, I mean, I'm going the other route as well, anyway. Mm hmm. Because. I mean, I'm not going to go with one credit. Yeah, That would be just be shoving it into their face. Because we were recently there and talked about the death yeah. and substantial amount. And if they look and see it's only one credit, they will know something is up. Yep. We're going to a thousand. What's the other computer? Which other one? The one on the oh, wall there? One. It's just a computer. Announcements. Okay, we've read those. Yep. Why did this go into third person mode? I have no idea. Just looting ammo. Nobody cares if I loot ammo. It weighs nothing. Should be a tablet there, and there isn't. Also, are those safes or no, no? Those are servers. Also, this particular stand right here, I own that tablet stand, <laughs> or at least used to. I might have gotten rid of it, but anyway, I didn't need to sneak down there. I just needed to lockpick my way in. What? Maybe there was a duct access as well. I didn't see one. They aren't always obvious. And there's a bolt cutter up there. Not that That looks. Uh, these are ducts, but they don't open. Yeah, they're not person sized. They're kitty sized. Yes. Not unless it's from that way, and I didn't want to walk that way for reasons. That's also a master lock that I can't open anyway. Hmm. So, no. Nope. I don't know, man. I don't know. Anyway, let's go kill a spacer. Yeah. Would like to join Sidonia in celebrating over 275 years of yeah, definitely do that before trying to pay off. Yes. 
Alright, time to leave Sidonia. I still have a lot of these to edit, but currently the computer that they are stored on does not have its hard drives, so I can't edit any of them right now. Reload your weapon? Because I can't imagine that clip size is 39. No. It's 40, isn't it? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Just a kilometer away. I can run that. Well, most characters. Or my normal character can. This character can't easily. You probably can't sprint the entire way, but you can... I can jump. Oh, Brennick's not very good with... Uh... Pack. No, he's Yet. not. They are not. Power to waste exit. Okay. <laughs> hey, look, it's lead. Who would have thought lead on Mars? But at least it's not as bad of a stupid lead world as that one world that we found <laughs> that was just lead. One resource and it's lead. Yeah. <laughs> the arch stupid lead world. And according to the planetary scans, um, Mars is a stupid lead world, but Equia Sam effect. Okay. I've already scanned it, haven't I? Wait, does that mean I didn't scan lead? No? Why, why aren't you mining it? Because I don't need to? You can use it to make drugs after you finish this research. <laughs> yes, where did it. where was it? Well, you've turned around so many times, I lost. Oh well, I'm not going to worry about it then. Okay, I'll let you know if I spot any others. It's a unique resource. Yes, it is. Can I pick up anything fun? Water. Water is fun. Yeah, especially water from a stupid lead world. So yeah, aqueous hematite does not count as one of the elements on mm -hmm. Mars. Because there aren't any veins of it. You can't extract it with an outpost. Okay. You just have to mine it manually. I mean, there's some in those mines. Yeah. Well, I figured the one that we're going to would have some. How many skill points into jetpacking do we have? One is my guess. Correct. Two. <laughs> it's a essential skill. Well, like, the first theory. The first point should have been given for free in the game, yeah. in my mind. And the fact that they didn't is kind of dumb to me. Because everybody needs it. Otherwise, you're missing a good chunk of the game. It's technically possible to go through the entire game without using a jetpack. But why would you? You have to have a pack anyway, because without it, your suit doesn't seal. Right. And why would you carry a pack that doesn't do anything? Well, it adds some resistances. Mm hmm And potentially enchantment stuff, like mm -hmm. better carrying capacity and the like. I forgot how bad this character is at actually sniping things. That's because I don't have an older hunting rifle. Oh, you are high level for this. And you were a boss, which... Or, 
an elite, which means you have equipment that I need. Damn it. And it's in Okay, I do actually have an older spell, hunting rifle. Oh, hi. Hi, Sam. I've forgotten what weapons I have. Mm -hmm. Huh? What was that? I thought I heard. Danger is going down. So if you mouse over something while you're in mm -hmm. scan mode, you will actually still see your meter. And that's the only time that you see it in scan mode? Mm, yeah. Oh. I didn't notice. I didn't notice either. Oh, I don't have any grenades equipped. Troubles. Try grenade. Dead now. Came from a grenade. That, that, that's okay. sad. Just low level things. How do I get at you? Up. Up over. Or not that high. No? Yes, that high. Uh. Uh, nope. You turn on your light. I'm not sure how he got in there. I don't think uh, I toggle clipping really yeah. fast. I'm sure there are bolt cutters around there. Yep. We'll use that as our excuse. Anybody outside? I can here. see what you mean about the glare. Yes. Like anything light gets blown out on this monitor, and I don't know why, because it is a color accurate monitor. It's just bad. Okay. Before I use the stupid shotgun, that's seriously the best DPS weapon I have. Mm -hmm. It is. Let's just use a tombstone. At least it has ammo, although not much of it. I need better weaponry. Um, so, did you loot the other elite one out outside? Ah, uh, no, I didn't. You are correct. Hopefully, it has something more useful than a cornered barrel knife. Yep. <laughs> did not mean to throw the grenade. No, it's an instigating UC naval cutlass. This always happens with me in killing elites, is that I end up with freaking it's... melee weapons. Yeah. And especially on this character, where they're doubly useless, because I'm not that good at stealth. This, my other character is a ninja. That makes more sense. This character is just... cautious. off the flashlight. The sad thing is YouTube quality is going to be higher than what we're seeing. Well, good for the people watching on YouTube. Yep. I miss my real monitor. Although I wouldn't be playing this on the real monitor because I need to record it 4K to match everything else. Tip the iceberg. You can bet there's more spacers ahead. And probably behind too.
least I got some chicken. This is not a silenced weapon, as I found out. <laughs> Oh, there's a level 14 facer punk. This feels like old times. I've got blood in my eyes. You are not a particularly accurate weapon, and you're far enough away where. Play peek -a -poo? Wanna play peek a -poo? Peek -a -poo. Okay, where are the others? Playing peek -boo and you're playing dead. You're dead now. You two are just doing nothing. You're doing nothing. Those are the. It's three of the four I see. So where's the four? They're shooting through the stairs. Okay, they're idiots. They're spacers. What's the difference? Mm, an idiot doesn't necessarily own a spacesuit. Mm. Not moving. And I don't see anybody else from here. Nope. nope. That counts as a solid surface, apparently. going. That doesn't though. And that didn't. Forgot I don't have that much oxygen. <laughs> Again, I'm used to my other character who has all of the oxygen, as you can attest to. Yeah, and you're even taking bricks and fitness. Yep. I don't know what that was, but dead now. Yeah, I don't think there are any friendlies in here. It's just out of range of showing up. Mm hmm. Yes, I see you down there. There we go. Fine zone. Could have done that without Jazz, you know? Glamorous, but it sure is profitable. He could have, but he chose not to. Yep, there you're coming up on camera. I'm assuming. At the very least, lower cat is. You could also step on me without using your claws. Any? Do not rub up against the trackball. Okay. The dead are down there. My target is over there. Underground, it looks like, further. Any? What are you doing? <laughs> It's really hard to control a first-person shooter when you have a cat rubbing up against your trackball thumb. Just saying. So? No kidding. Kitty! That was the space bar! <laughs> He's hungry. 
So, yeah. It is past the o'clock food time. Okay, where did the other ones go? Oh, those are tutelage nests. Okay. Use the cutter. Never knew that. Yeah, I guess those weren't uh, fully grown. Yeah, we didn't get it um, visible when we were going through the Crete research lab, but there was one of those in a locker where mm. uh, heat leech just burst from it. Oh, there's no one. Hmm. Weird that they're here. No. It's Mars. I mean, people have been here at for... So what it is, is that Zone is using his hind legs to walk on me, and his hind legs have very sharp claws. Wow. So, uh, bigger than I expected. Trying to find where all the dead bodies are. Here they are. At least some of them. That's it. Take my map. Oh. At... No, you're not the most graceful. No. Sensor chip refined space trucker space helmet. If it's better armor than the one we have, I think. What are we using? Mechanized pirate that's who's sniper space suit. Oh, that's right, helmet. Plus two hacker. It is better than what we have. Yep, we should probably. S maybe not right now because we're not in a oxygen area. I yeah, but can, can extra you... capacity is fine. Yeah. Okay, you can't just change yeah, it. Yeah, of course you can. Even though... Lore-wise, it makes no you sense, can but... Take off your helmet here. You can hold your breath, right? Yeah. Hold your breath, take off your helmet, and put on the new one. That's totally the way this works. Yeah, one time my pack was on fire, and I tried unequipping it, and it screamed to me about suit integrity. Mm. So, I learned not to do that. Okay, so we can't go that way. We need to go this way. I really wish you could use the fire extinguisher junk item to put out your, yes. yourself when you're on fire. But, nope, this item can't be equipped. Nope, it is just junk. And Zone went back to his birch. I see you. Same. Not that I can see anything in the blacks on this monitor. <sighs> I mean, it's not even that great of a work monitor. That's the sad part. I didn't see what those things were. Uh, impact driver and mm. stuff like that. Sam, what are you doing? Sam? Sneaking? Didn't know he could do that. I bet he didn't either. Oh. Hi. Honestly, it's that light. You probably kill it with the yeah. cutter. Yeah. I have killed a lot of spacers with my cutter. I mean, I'm also not that or high pi level. Pirates. Like, sometimes when it's a below level 40, I'll just... I don't need to spend ammo on you. Right, but again, I don't have that much... Not gonna be your... Like, what level am I? Fourteen. Fourteen. I'm not that much higher level. Give 
going to come out and play? Or am I going to have to jump over to you? Yes, you did. Furious calibrated solstice. Furious with me. And yes, I know there's lockers. Oh! That's an expert locked locker? Okay. Well, you fit perfect. Oh, no, it's not perfect. Never mind. Yeah, and you don't. Yeah, you do have one. One. Yeah, but I only have one. So, do I have a pair of twos that'll fit? I only have one two that fits. No, it doesn't fit. Game. It does fit. Oh, right. It fits there. And this. Nope. 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 It has to be the three. Auto slotting just to make sure. So this is still fine. All that for a protein bar and red wine. Yes, yes, I'm overburdened. I know. Really? Just found that there's no enemies around. Already grabbed it. Baseball cap, foam cup, tape measure, and a minor bat hard hat. Ball. Yes, I know. It's bat ball and not baseball. Orange juice, but not of transcendence. Indeed. So, uh, Kater found an orange juice of transcendence. And it's worse than orange juice. Heal face, don't mind if I do. Same with credits. I'll take the frag grenade that I accidentally used earlier. If there's anything here that I particularly care about, I believe the answer is no. Yeah, alien jerky is particularly useless, but. But there should be a eat button. That is coming. I think it might even be coming in the next patch, but Bethesda hasn't announced exactly what's in that yet. But you have some health you could heal, though. So... Why yeah. not pick up the food and eat it? Because it takes so much effort to do so. It's a real-time drawback rather than mm. anything else. Oh boy. Chunks cap. None of these terminals are online. We're in heretic breakings. Door. Can sell them at the trade at the I suppose. Yep. Which we're going to be going to, and we don't have to leave surface to do so. So might as well. So much junk everywhere. We have about five minutes left on the timer. Okay. Oh, 
Well, let's just finish this up. Can't even combat slide. I know. Combat slide for reference. Combat slide, for reference, is when you are running and then shift into a crouch for stealth. It actually makes you slide. It just looks cool. I don't know if it's very useful. Why did you not die from one hit? I mean, I know I'm not that good at stealth, but... That's CQBX, right? The pill bottle on the ground? Yes. Yep. Which is almost useless. Wow, these guys went big. Some serious engineering. Yeah, but... Basers have this place now, which means they're filled with idiots. I know there was another spacer. Take the good stuff, leave the rest. Take everything, leave nothing, got it. <clears throat> Maybe there wasn't, and I was just missing that there were two spacers there. Entrance is blocked. Might be a way into the cave. So Sam apparently has a lot of dialogue for this quest. I think all of the constellation companions do. Hmm. Barrett had a lot to say about this place too. Oh no, it's Aqueous Hematite. Mm -hmm. Here. Happy. Or not. At aim? It's not a... That is the side that I have to hit for it. You know Bethesda and their hitboxes. A lot of aqueous hematite here. Mm -hmm. Of course, I had been in here and mined it all up before going in here for the quest. Of course you did. Better hitboxes on these things. I'm still nearby something. This looks like the jackpot. Tell me you got a cutter handy. Never wise to be in my way. That sounded like a big weapon. It looked like a lawgiver. Mm hmm. That counts as a big weapon to me. Yes, I know I'm taking damage from holding my breath. Well, that was the boss. You just, you're the one that told me to pull out my cutter. It's because you're all encumbered. Yes, I know. Right. 
think there was anything else. And that's still highlighting. But I can't find any angle to get at it. None at all. Hmm. So we're not touching it. Yeah, it's not really worth the bomber at that point. Technician's refined, refined ground crew pack has no boost pack. None at all. Galvanized shock troop power pack. That might be better than what I have boost pack wise. I'm not a huge fan of power packs, but I think that's, yeah, that's already what I have. Nope, it is worse in almost every way. Ah, that is loud. Yeah, it is. Anyway, um, just finishing up, then heading back, and the heading back part will be next time. Just want to finish up this area because I've accomplished the goal, which means that it is almost certainly well, just. Well, you need to find the intercom and talk to the guy. I do. Yeah. Oh, you're in combat. getting smarter and actually approaching. And, you know... Laying down forward yeah. fire. Unfortunately, they're still idiots. Why were you not getting hit? So, why do we, what do you mean by finding the intercom? I already got the quest objective completed. No, you got the quest objective of killing the leader. Yeah. Which is all I need to do here. I know I need to do that part still. I was just talking about this dungeon. You gonna come back out? Or am I gonna have to shoot your feet? Oh, you're crawling because you're heavily injured. Motion gravity. We not need not. Deep mining spacesuit. Yeah, my plan was just to get to the point of leaving here. Which is apparently where I am. I'm surprised there isn't a digit magazine. Pick? Oh, those are pen. Oh, no. Ratchet. Yeah, no, these are just tools. It was just the handle of the screwdriver. Yep. That, however, are credits. And that is where we're going to yeah. stop. Yeah. That's what I was trying to get to, not completing the entire quest. All right. Hope you've enjoyed this, Internet. And we'll talk to you next time. Okay. Hopefully, no, it, you'll probably still be short next time. Probably knowing me. <laughs> Bye.